Welcome. 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 The Kitchen and Jorn Show. The Kitchen and Jorn Show. The Kitchen and Jorn Brie and Floor Show. We're on the floor because this is Honey Bear's very own video. You can see how excited she is. This video is about how we got Honey Bear and also mm -hmm. about Honey Bear and also lots yeah. of vlogs about Honey Bear. Yeah. Yeah. Our audience has been very obsessed with Honey Bear and has wanted a video about her for a while. So mm -hmm. we decided to oblige you guys. We've christened everything in our house uh, after her name. So this mm -hmm. is the Honey Perch. There's the Honey Beds, which are her three dog beds. That's mm -hmm. one behind us. In the office is uh, the Honeycomb Hideout. There's the Honey Treats, which are coming. Honey Foods are in the freezer because she yeah. eats fresh fruit. She's fruit. A fruit. 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 This MF said fruit. <laughs> she eats fresh food, okay? But she's a princess. Yeah, no one makes fun of Honey Bear because she can't pronounce food correctly. Sorry, the standards for you are slightly higher than for our dog. All right, let's tell the story of Honey Bear. <laughs> December of 2021, uh, Kristen comes to me and sticks a phone in my face and is just like, look at this dog. Oh, no f***ing way. There was a dog who was available for Foster, and her mm -hmm. name was Honey Bear, mm -hmm. and she had that face. This dog could do absolutely nothing. It's like a celebrity has walked into the apartment. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh my god, look who's here. I gotta get a picture with Honey Bear. We wanted to get a dog for a while, mm -hmm. uh, and so I was like, why don't we just foster? And, and after the reorg, when we could, like, to have a dog in here and they, they wouldn't be miserable. Yeah. There's a video about it. You can actually click on it. Click it's, on it. It's above here somewhere. We brought Honey Bear home on December 13th, mm -hmm. 2021. Her mom who had her last. Had other pets. Had other pets. And young children. And young children. Mm -hmm. And like Honey Bear, as we learned very quickly, needed to be the only dog in the home. And honestly, probably the only little creature in the home. She's good visiting kids, but like, she she kind of needs to have run of the run of the space. She now has run of our house and she has three beds and we're making a video about her and see if she's gonna sleep through it probably. Honey Bear, do you want a treat? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh boy. Honey Bear. Okay, we're gonna see her do her tricks. Honey Bear, can you sit? See, she <laughs> so she does it preemptively. She does it preemptively because she knows she gets a treat. Mm -hmm. When she wants a treat sometimes, she'll just sit and be like, mm -hmm. <laughs> Honey Bear's a Sharpay, she's mm -hmm. eight years old. Mm -hmm. And the thing about Sharpays is they're very particular. They're very cat-like. They were they were bred as guard dogs. That's why they have the loose skin. So yeah, if the they get bit. Kind they of get yeah. bit doesn't matter, but no mm -hmm. one's gonna bite her because she is because she's a princess. She's a princess. Yeah, princess. When we first brought her in, she was very very nervous because she was in a new in a new place. You know, it took her it took a while for her to she like. She was a little jumpy. She was she very jumpy. jumpy. She was very it took nervous. her a while for her to uh, relax. Relax and let us like take her outside and things like that. Honestly, we kind of fell in love with her really early. Mm -hmm. Cause like, she's just such a, also she loves Brie. She does. I don't know if y'all follow me on Twitter, but like Honey Bear has two mommies, but like one mommy is like uppercase mommy. And one mommy is like lowercase mommy. The other thing is she loves baby talk. Mm-hmm. She, she loves baby talk. It makes me her tail starts wagging when you talk to her baby talk. I don't know what it is. Anyway, so we wanted to adopt this dog. However, yeah. unfortunately, Jen is very allergic to dogs. I'm the baby. <laughs> we can only have one baby, and Jen is the baby of the house. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately. But I really only react to her, like if you guys haven't vacuumed in a couple of days mm -hmm. or if like I sit on something. So I, I am allergic to her, but not so allergic that I can't be in the house with her. And once that was established, it was like, well, there's really nothing against you guys making her a permanent fixture I here. know, mm -hmm. but I felt bad for a while because we, we basically, we bought a new vacuum and then we're mm -hmm. also going to get a new couch. Jen agreed that we could adopt Honey Bear. I think mostly because Jen saw how attached we were mm -hmm. uh, and didn't want to say no. Also, she took the little thing with her ears. When she hears things, she sometimes does like this. Oh, read our ears. It sucks because the cutest parts of her are facing us. I know. And everything else is just like ass, 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 ass. So we ended up adopting her in January? January, yes. Yes. We of have 2022. Of 2022. 2022. Oh, what shelter did you guys go through? Wags, Wags and Walks. And walks in, here in Los Angeles. They're out in uh, Culver City. They're a great organization. Mm -hmm. They've been like really helpful for us and stuff like mm -hmm. that. And I'm still on their foster list because like, Maybe I could foster another one someday. <laughs> so we've learned a lot of things about her. Mm -hmm. She is definitely a Sharpay. Were you chewing on the sticky blanket? Okay, well, I guess you won't stand for these accusations. She does not do things. That she doesn't want to do, like doesn't. stay in this video. She's very food motivated. Very she does insanely not know. food motivated. Hey Bear. Say treat. Hey Bear, treat. 
She does sometimes do like little play. Like she'll do like three seconds of play fighting, mm -hmm. and then she'll be like, "All right, time to sleep." So she was a. We believe you guys from what you were told by the rescue that she's yeah. probably a former puppy mill mm -hmm. reader, and and they can tell because her nipples are really distended, which usually means that she, they were They're basically abusing this dog, yes. forcing her to have puppy after puppy mm -hmm. after puppy. And which like, which is why puppy mills are bad. They're really bad, and she was found wandering around, and then like she was picked mm -hmm. up by a shelter when she was six. I mean, honestly, for a dog that like probably has been horrifically abused. Mm -hmm. She's very sweet. She is really sweet. Um, She's well behaved. She, like, you know, again, she has her anxiety around other dogs, but, like, you know, she she never do anything to anyone. She has snapped at me a couple times. She, well, well, the thing is, is, like, she's very protective of her personal space. Mm -hmm. And when she's in, like, certain spaces of the apartment, I know not to go near her because that's her personal time. And mm -hmm. I will not bother Honey Bear. And now, right now, she's, like, on the prowl because she's like, there's food in them there hills. Honey Bear, can you show anyone anything but your butt? Nope. Don't zoom in on it. <laughs> <laughs> we plan to give her a ton of treats for this video, so like, don't be all like, you're giving the dog too many treats. Like, calm down. Yeah, you're not the fine. dog's nutritionist. This is a no fat shaming any mammals. You can fat shame fish though. They deserve it. What have you learned about having a dog? I've learned a lot of things. I've learned that I hate getting up at 5 a.m. Well, that's why I do it. She honestly, it's a lot like having a toddler. It really is. A toddler that can't talk to you. Mm -hmm. So okay. what are some cute, silly, funny things that Honey Bear does that make you love her? When it's time for Honey Bear to eat, Honey Bear is just like- We set a we set a reminder on our Alexa that at 5.30, it's just like, this is your reminder to feed Honey Bear. And Honey Bear is just like, yes, 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 time, 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 she'll hear She'll hear the chimes and she literally does Pavlov's dog. Like mm -hmm. she literally is like, is it time? <gasps> this is a reminder. Eat honey bear. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. She also gets very excited when she sees us for the first time mm -hmm. every day. She does this thing where she'll bend her little body almost in half. Like she'll be like a little C shape. What are you doing? You were some little itch? Oh, your little scratches? Oh, you yeah, settle back down. Little scratches. Little scratches. Little scratches. Scratches. Mm hmm She'll kind of like, roll. she'll she'll be, yeah, she'll be like a little crescent roll where like, she'll kind of be wiggling her butt and she'll also be wiggling her front. Well, you got a dog for like companionship, right? We did, and we did get a cat. Mm -hmm. This is a cat. We mm -hmm. did accidentally get a cat, so that's our bad. I love her and I'm obsessed with this dog. Yes, yes you are. Probably my last Sharpay. <laughs> Because the thing is, is that I'm obsessed with this dog. This dog is obsessed with Brie. I'm fine. She's she just, does like you more than other people. Like she recognized that you're a special person to her, mm -hmm. and that like, yeah. if Brie is gone and it's like Jen and Kristen, she obviously is like Kristen, Kristen, Kristen. I mean, when Brie comes home, it's like Santa has come home. Yes. We hear Mama coming down the hall. Oh, hi. hi. Warp me next time. Hi, hi girl. Hi. hi, girl. I'm very insecure about the dog. Yes, yes, you are. I'm tremendously insecure. Yes, you are, but she loves you so much. I know, I love her so much. She is the best girl. She is a good dog. Honey Bear's having surgery tomorrow. Mm -hmm. um, she has a condition uh, that's very common with Sharpay's. It's called entropion, uh, where basically her eyelid kind of like bends in. Mm -hmm. So her eyelashes are scraping her eye. And it hurts her. It does. It's painful. So mm -hmm. we're getting it fixed. Mm -hmm. And it is not cheap. <laughs> yeah, that's what insurance is for. That's why we love you. We love you so much. We love you just as much as going on vacation because that's what it costs. <laughs> we bought a ramp for the dog um, and I tried to explain how it worked with the dog and I didn't realize that like, I didn't know how to show a dog how to use a ramp. So I thought that like if I used the ramp, she would follow me up the ramp. I don't know why I thought this. I put the ramp on our bed and so like I thought, well, the ramp can't support my weight, but maybe if I just do like a glancing, like just sort of like- Maybe if I just step real lightly. Well, maybe just like a glancing blow on top of the ramp. And what ended up happening was I stepped on the ramp, fell onto the bed, hit my shins on the bed frame, got twisted up in the curtains, and then fell flat on my back off the side of the bed. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, ow! I got the wind knocked out of me. She was not, she left the room. Do yeah. you still have this ramp? Yeah. yeah. Did she ever use it? No. No, we've tried, I mean here, you want me to go get the ramp? No. no. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> She's supposed to walk up that? No. I okay. <laughs> anyway, so I tried to walk on this and I fell on my ass. <laughs> Honey bear. Look, here, I'll do it. Yeah, see? That's what I... <gasps> Ooh. Please don't hurt yourself again. <gasps> see? Oh, yeah. Honey bear, do you understand now? <laughs> there. It's right there. Okay, let's all, let's all not look at her and see if we'll figure out where the treats are. Okay. 
No, no. Over no, here. No, nothing. No. Kristen, show your hands. I have nothing. nothing. I have nothing. nothing. Nothing in here. There's nothing. No, no treats. Honey, nothing. No. We have nothing. Honey, but there's so many treats. Honey. Look, honey. Look, honey. <laughs> yeah, Kristen, yeah, Kristen, sit over here. Oh, Kristen, sit over Let's here. Let's give no options. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look. You can go down it too. See? See? This could be honey bear. Come here. Look. They're there. Oh, she her, knows they're her, there. Just let her do it. Okay, I'm letting her do it. Is she doing it? <laughs> no, not wait, as okay, such. Wait, wait, maybe. Okay, bye. Well, but maybe. Maybe she's going to come up. Just one paw. You can do it, honey bear. You know where they are. Just one paw on the ramp. No. No, no she's not going to get it. <laughs> she's just trying to eat all the treats. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, honeys. Just walk up here. It's okay. One foot. So, thanks for tuning in to anyway, this very special episode very of the nice. Kitchen and Jordan Show, where we learned about this little dog. What other fun, cool videos do you want us to make next? Yep, she loves this ramp. <laughs> she loves, she and the ramp are just like, ramp is her new mommy now. Mm -hmm. Okay, this video's over. <laughs> Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Maybe she's worried that it's not stable. I don't think she cares about the structural integrity no. of this ramp.